Hello, I'm Alan Ram, president and founder of Alan Ram's Proactive Training Solutions. And here's what's got me fired up today. Confusion over how to really sustain training and process long-term. So here's my disclaimer. As a training company, we offer live as well as online training products. Both have a place. Today, when it seems that anybody that is anybody in the training space has an online platform, and let's face it, Lightspeed is the 8,000 pound rhinoceros in that space, I think it's important that everyone understand what they're getting and what they're looking for from any trainer or training program. Dealers call companies like mine every day and ask for training. Some make it a point to specify that they want live training. So here's what they're asking for. They want someone to come in and talk to their people. Here's what that looks like. This person then talks for several hours a day for a few days explaining whatever it is they explain. Here's the first problem with that. While it was called training, it was more likely educational. There's a big difference between the two. It's the difference between watching football on TV and actually being a participant at an NFL training camp. At the end of the week, the dealer gets an invoice for training. He doesn't mind paying it because everyone's pumped up and he's heard nothing but good things from his staff. They're excited about all those stories they heard in that conference room. A couple weeks later, the trainer follows up only to hear the dealer say, well, they were pumped up for about a week after you left, but now they're back to doing what they were doing before. Also, our used car manager, Bruce, quit and took a handful of guys with him. So we're in the process now of hiring a used car manager and some more salespeople. We're probably gonna have to get you back out here pretty soon. Here's the problem with what happened in that conference room. While your people were sitting in that room for seven hours listening to 582 closes, that will stop any shopper, their attention span started to fade after about 20 minutes. That's just plain old physiology. Secondly, everyone learns at a different rate. Some people hear things once and they get it, while others have to hear it 15 times before it sinks in. The third thing is that we all know that repetition is the mother of learning. Training is not about a one-time pump up. Those of you that have younger kids know that. Your kids will hear a song once and it makes an impression. Either they like it or they don't. If they like it, they download it and then listen to it 1,567 times. That's how they're able to bust out a rap concert when Aunt Irma comes over for Sunday dinner. It's all about repetition. Now, even if that trainer did simulate or actually train during that session, now what? It's not enough. If you want to be a good golfer, you don't just hit a bucket of balls once every six months when the golf coach comes through town. You have to do it daily. Baseball teams take batting practice every day, fielding practice every day. It's not an annual thing. That's why I'm a fan of the online platforms. Let me just hit you between the eyes with this. If I myself was to come work at your dealership as a manager, you would have to have my online platform. Why would I take hostages in a room for hours on end when that education could easily be delivered online at everyone's individual pace? 15 minutes a day in a way that also tracks and monitors for a fraction of the cost. What I would then do being a manager is simulate. I would actually train just like someone at your dealership needs to be doing on a consistent basis. It really doesn't take long if they know what they're doing. I would role play different skills for a few minutes a day. That's about what it takes and that's training. Let's quit confusing education and actual training. Here's my final view on these online platforms. They are invaluable tools to help your managers get the job done. Managers need good tools. Let's say a contractor showed up at your house to build you a guest house. He shows up with just a hammer and a screwdriver. I guess he could eventually get it done, but couldn't he get it done way faster with a whole bunch of kick-ass power tools and some direction? Online platforms are the power tools management should use to get the job done better and faster. They make training sustainable in the real world environment of the dealership. You hire someone on a Tuesday, they can be getting logged in that same day versus waiting 14 weeks for your live educator to roll back into town. I like live events for momentum builders. They can be the concert that gets your team excited about the music. It's just important that you understand that as a standalone, they're not sustainable long term. Live events are also good when concept and process are being discussed and collective feedback fuels the conversation. The 20 group concept or management process workshops, for example. 
It all has a place and making sure that you have a solution that fits what you're trying to accomplish is key. If you want to find out more about our power tools, please call my office at 866-996-4665. Thanks for letting me get that off my chest.